All right, recording in the house again. This is what I've got to do before I leave the house, right? Because they started changing their tactics. And yeah, they didn't use the neighbors. Uh, two days before when leaving, I mean, when in the house and also when leaving, they didn't use the neighbors. They used missing brake light uh, at the lights, the first lights. So yeah, I'm putting on my socks and I'll say when I've got to do my cigarettes. That's what I do every time before I leave the house. Alright, so I'm making my cigarettes. It's going to take me around 10 minutes. Like always. Alright, so the last time I left the house, they didn't use the neighbours uh, when I was in the house filming, like you're seeing here, and also when I drove out. So they gave it a one day break from using the neighbours, and you're going to see the tactics change this time. And you can see I'm fast forwarding the video, and you can see, and you can hear, it takes me 10 minutes uh, to make my cigarettes. And what you're going to see soon is uh, the tactics change. You're going to see a stalker parking at the front of the house, and just stay in the car, and then boots off. But you're going to see, before he boots off, uh, you're going to hear me speaking about how the neighbours have got uh, the equipment where they can see through your walls and they're in communication with the stalker that's at the front of the house, right? And right when I say that, he boots off, right? And the link will be down below uh, to show you how they can see through your walls, right? And that's the title. Keep watching. Two cigarettes to go. <laughs> right. Ah, uh, you can see the time. Like I said, it takes around ten minutes. So, see if the stalker gets out the car. Look, look, creeping forward. See what happens. <sighs> Last cigarette to go. So the chances are he's on the phone because like I said, uh, they've got devices on surrounding the target in the stalker's houses that surround the target. They've got the devices where they can see what you're doing, right? Oh, he boots off now. Oh, <laughs> right when I fucking said it. <laughs> All right, wake up to my work, All right? whole neighbourhood infiltrated, not just my neighbourhood. And it doesn't matter which neighbourhood you live in, uh, it's a certain percentage of stalkers already there. It's always been like that. But it's just my neighbourhood's like 100%. <laughs> not just one neighbourhood. But you've seen that there, right? Alright. Alright, so I'm done. Alright, so you can see how the stalker boots off. As soon as I said uh, the neighbours are in communication with that stalker at the front. And you can see uh, when he boots off, uh, as soon as I finish making my cigarettes, right? You can see that there. So they didn't use the neighbours when driving out. Uh, but yeah, I'll show you me walking out and driving off uh, just to show you how I'm leaving the house, right? So yeah, keep watching. I'll uh, show you me uh, walking towards the car. You can see that white car, right? That's what happens when you're really targeted, right?
So the bins are where the gate is, but I've got to check the letterbox as well. So do you reckon they're going to double it? So you can see the assignment's been done with that white car. Also, they had a grey car slow stopped. Like I said, when you keep on documenting every single time you go out, the tactics will change, right? All right. All right, so what I'm going to show you now is me heading to High Point, uh, across the road from High Point, and you can see me going to three locations, and you're going to see how the tactics will change from location to location, because I park and then walk from location to location. You're going to see how, how the stalkers are set up at each location, and also filming the target, right? You're going to see how obvious that stalker makes it, and again, it's all about the timing. So as you can see right now, uh, again, prepared to boot off, right? And yeah, two days before, they gave it a break. They didn't use the neighbors, and you can see what they used on this day while I was in the house. Uh, right when I finished making the cigarettes, you can see the stalker at the front of the house. Again, in communication with the stalkers that live, with any of the stalkers that live uh, that surround the target, right? Uh, that stalker in the car could be communicating with, uh, you know, pick which house, right? Uh, yeah, so again, the link will be down below if you wanna know how they can see through your walls. And yeah, they've had that technology for a very long time, right? And that video shows you how uh, a targeted individual in the United States, the police were targeting this guy and eventually they killed him. And they actually show the device they use to see through your walls, right? So yeah, keep watching and show you me heading to High Point and show you the stalkers doing their assignments. Keep watching. No, I'm going to park right here. No, no stalkers in their cars. No. Alright, I'll park here. Alright, so... Different tactics used when I was uh, in the house, right? And the car stopped. Different tactic they used this time. You can hear me saying, right? Uh, surrounding houses are... One of the houses are looking at the target, or it could be... Maybe two houses, you don't know, right? That's the way they work. Needs to be confirmed, right? Uh, yeah, so as soon as I said it, that they're communicating with the stalker outside, he leaves. And I've also shown you when the same thing, I'm filming with the security, uh, the my spy camera glasses, uh, the security camera, and I had a stalker in front of the house. So he was on the phone, uh, yeah, in his car, just parked in front of my house. And I waited for a few minutes filming the security camera, then I go. I'm gonna walk out now, and uh, you're gonna see him uh, boot off. And as soon as I open the door, uh, you can see uh, he's already started moving, right? Before I even open the door, he already started driving, right? Uh, that's what happens when you're on the what, government watch list. All right, so you can hear me saying about when I was at home filming the security camera. And I had a stalker parked at the front of the house, like you saw when I was in the house uh, at the beginning of the video. And I stayed there for a few minutes filming the stalker just at the front of the house. He was on the phone in his car. And then you can hear me saying, um, I'm going to walk out. And as soon as I open the door, he's going to boot off. And that's what you saw, right? And I made a video about two years ago showing you that. So I'm fast forwarding the video now. And also I slowed it down, zoomed it into the factory. You see the door closed. Uh, that's going to be uh, start to open when I walk to my car. And that's the tactics they're going to use when I head back to my car. So I'm heading to uh, Officeworks right now. And you're going to see uh, the stalker being used. Uh, he's going to walk out of a store and just hang around, but he's going to make sure his uh, phone camera is pointing at the target while the phone's at his ear. And they're going to use that guy two times, right? So yeah, keep watching. Before I walk in, I'll hang at the front and you're going to see that stalker doing his assignment. Keep watching.
that I'm having a cigarette before I walk in. But yeah, uh, when I walk out, you get stalkers on their phones at the front. You got a stalker over there, looks like a worker on the phone. signal as well over there as well you can see this dude right and he's making sure that the camera is facing me while when Sonny's here and I've shown you uh, I've shown you how the stalkers will use it how I roll them to make sure they face the camera towards the target right and I've shown you that a few times before so you can see this dude here Why would you walk over here where the trolleys are, direct the camera, and then just walk straight off? Why would you do that, right? Right, why would you do it? If it's not what I'm saying, right? Directing the camera, look, boots off. Why would you come over here for? Stares at the target, hand signals, at the other stalkers, and then boots off, that's it. Why do that, right? And again, I've proven how, how they do that, and I've rolled them a few times. Flood my work. All right, so you can see that stalker's body language. You can see where he was hanging around before he walked off, right? And you can hear me saying about, uh, you know, directing the phone at the cam uh, at the target when they got the phone to the ear. And I've shown you plenty of times on how I've caught them out, right? Forcing them to direct the camera because uh, just to prove it on how they're doing their assignments, right? And that's one of the ways they catch the target on camera. But soon I'll show you a uh, stalker actually filming the target, right? So, yeah. That stalker you saw uh, doing his assignment, he walked off. Uh, you're gonna see him again soon. He's gonna be in position. And yeah, I'm not gonna show you any assignments being done inside office work, so I was in there for a bit too long. So I'm gonna skip that location there, uh, showing you assignments being done in the store. And I'm showing you me walking out right now. And you're gonna see that stalker again. Uh, he's gonna be in position a bit further up uh, as I'm walking past, right? And then it gets, uh, you know, the batting gets passed to the next stalkers when I'm uh, heading into the next location. Keep watching. Oh, it's that same dude. Look at this. It's the same dude. Fantastic furniture. No, I think I need to go there. His job's done, right? You can see that there, right? You can see how they were using him, the way he's uh, directing the camera. Alright, so you can see the stalk is in another position, and I was in office works for around 15 to 20 minutes, so he's been on the phone the whole time, and changed his position, because uh, I know which path I've got to take, and you can see uh, his assignment's done. So I'm heading to um, uh, the good guys now, and you're going to see the assignment's being done, how they're prepared inside the store, and then I'll show you me heading to uh, JB Hi-Fi, that uh, yellow store you see right ahead. And again, you're going to see how they prepared, right? And also, it's all about the timing, stalker film in the target. So you keep watching, I'm going to walk into uh, the good guys right now, right up ahead, and you're going to see how the stalkers are already in position. Keep watching. <clears throat> Actually, we'll go to the good guys and see if they sell it there. Air purifiers.
You could see how they just fucking dotted everywhere. I knew what I was going to do. Oh, he's fucking fine. That's the other dude. I think they sell that brand here. Alright, I'm walking out. I must have one of these. Oh, I'm gonna go. Now I'm heading to JB. Alright, so you can see how the stalkers are prepared at each location I go to. And I didn't show you any signs being done inside office work, so I was in there for around 15 to 20 minutes because uh, I don't want the video to go for too long. But you can see before I walked into office works, and you can see when walking out, and you can see uh, how they're in position, right? And when walking into uh, the good guys, you can see how they're in position. And you're going to see a stalker right now before I walk into JB Hi Fi. Uh, you're going to see a stalker timing it filming the target right and you can see how the handlers in the communication in real time so they can time it right because the targets on watch the whole time keep them watching you see the stalker filming the target keep them watching she starts smiling look at this now she takes pictures, look at this. Hi, oh, have you got the time? You got the time? Yeah. Taking pictures of the store? Yeah. First time you've seen it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> I love my work. Keep watching. Alright, so you can see how that was timed, making it that she's filming the store, but you can see how she's directing the camera, right? And again, it's all about the timing, and you don't see the same stalkers twice, I've been doing this for five years, and again, the last percentage of the population in each city worldwide are working for the state. So as you can see, I'm walking into the store right now, and you're going to see a worker and a customer doing their assignments, and I'm looking for um, air purifiers, and I'm looking to upgrade for what i got at home, just looking around, right? Uh, for air purifiers and yeah you can see a worker and uh, a customer doing their assignment they're having a fake chat first and then when I tell them about air purifiers whereabouts are they uh, all of a sudden they end up uh, heading to where I gotta look at my air purifiers and they'll just fake it looking at air purifiers right keep watching uh, air purifiers air purifiers oh, okay your, your security Oh, it's out there. Hey, mate, how uh, you going? Air purifiers? Or... Just down there, mate. Oh, thanks. Alright, so you can hear me saying uh, where the air, air purifiers are, you can see them uh, having a fake chat, and all of a sudden they're going to head to where the uh, air purifiers are and have a fake chat there about air purifiers. Keep watching. It's on special from like $8.99. Yeah. Oh, what's this one? It's yeah, all awesome air purifiers. Yeah, it's 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 easy. Easy. Is it really good? Yeah. Alright, guys. Basically, without it sends iron and iron particles into the air. Yep. Which then attracts negative particles. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah, and then basically um, attracts it and then gets rid of it and clears the air and yeah. Yeah, that's what that nano works does. We'll put it in the air. Uh, yeah. Is that right? Yeah. And it does a, a huge square meter. Yeah, 
Yeah. I'm gonna go. All right, you can see that there. Uh, they were having, they were staring at me the whole time. Then I go pure fries, and then all of a sudden they're deciding, you know what, we'll go next to pure fries and speak about pure fries, right? All right, so as I'm walking back to my car, uh, you're gonna see the garage door open. I showed you at the beginning, it was closed, and when heading back to my car, it starts to open, and that's uh, close to my car, right? And that's the signs being done when heading back to my car. Keep watching. You can see constantly, right? Constantly, constantly, right? All right, heading back to my car. Keep watching. Oh, it's starting to rain, you gotta be kidding me. So I'm gonna put my head down, starting to spit. I wanna get the lens wet. God damn it. Alright, now that opens. Alright, so you can see the garage door opening and the car driving out and just stays in that spot you see right there. And I've got to head back this way, right? So you can see uh, how it's timed uh, to let the target know he's on watch. And it's done so the target sees it. And yeah, so you can see uh, how the organised stalking works and how you don't see the same stalkers twice and only a certain amount of stalkers are chosen to do assignments at each location the target heads to. Alright, so as you can see, the car's close by, and when I left this location, I went to uh, Caroline Spring Shopping Centre. I uh, can't show you that because the video's gone for way too long as it is. Uh, yeah, but when I parked, no signs were done, but when heading back to my car, they used security. So yeah, this is going to end up showing you my targeting, but like always, keep on watching. Government stage, false lap.